take off, somebody decided that they did not want to wear their mask the right way. I have the chocolate. up again and making our usual coffee run unlike how it normally is here right now it's like pretty dead there's not that many people up right now um, I think anyone that's up at 6 or earlier it's usually like tourists because of the jet lag but we are up we're gonna go to a different place for breakfast I've actually been there before with my family when we were here the first time and it's so good so excited for it but because we have like two hours before they open, right? Like two hours before they open, we're gonna get some coffee um, at a local spot here. So we'll check it in a bit.
way bar looks like a strip club. <laughs> Mm. Soft serve. Should we just do the soft serve matcha ice cube? Hello. So it got really, really hot. I had to put my hair up, but we're actually waiting uh, for this place to open because we're going to get some soft serve. Perfect timing because it's really humid and muggy. So we're going to get some soft serve, but it's not just regular soft serve ice cream. It's matcha. And this place is supposed to be really, really good. I love matcha. So we're gonna get some and I will let you know how it is. We got our ice cream. Eric's is huge. You didn't anticipate it being that big. <laughs> I just dropped one of the balls. I don't even know where it is. <laughs> yeah, his is huge. You didn't anticipate it being that big. This is mine. I got the matcha and vanilla mix and it is so good. It is sweet, but it's not like overly, overly sweet. You wanna try it, baby? Oh, I know. So now we're trying to make it to our trolley and eat ice cream before it melts. big meal during lunch we kind of don't eat anything too big or like enjoy the meal at dinner so instead we're gonna have a little bit of a snack maybe get a drink to cool off a little bit we're at the same marketplace we came to on monday just because they have really good stands here and there's really good deals sometimes on meals and food here and there's just so many places to try so we're gonna have a little bit of a snack and i'm so excited this looks so good Obviously, we gotta go back eventually. Today, we're actually, uh, well, we were actually able to rent a car. So we're gonna get out of Waikiki, out of the city a little bit and head to the southeast side. There's a lot of other beaches there, some really cool spots we wanna check out, some food we wanna check out, of course. We finished eating breakfast this morning at Duke's and it was a buffet, so we are still stuffed. So before we um, take an Uber to go pick up our car, we're just gonna walk around. I gotta get some gifts for my coworkers at the office and my brother because he's so graciously taking care of our dogs. So we're just walking around a little bit, trying to walk off this food, pick up those things, and then we will hop in the Uber and get our car. Bit of a detour. Where were you going? To see if we can get a haircut. To see if he can get a haircut because the hair on the back of his neck is bugging him. And it's been like exactly a week since he gets his weekly haircut. So he actually found a spot with really good reviews. We're gonna see if they're open um, and see if we can get a haircut. So we were on our way to the hotel to pick up our things before we head out to the west side or east side. But we drove past this place that we've been wanting to go to since we got here. It came like highly recommended. All the videos we saw and everybody who has been to Hawaii told us that we had to stop here. It's called Leonard's Bakery. They have this uh, treat. It's called a malasada puff and it's like a donut and it's filled and they have different flavors and we heard that it was so good. So that's what we're going to try right now. Very excited because I've been wanting to try it since we got here. But it's a little bit of a drive from our hotel and from where we're staying, so we couldn't do it till today. 
on the side of the road because as we were driving past this view we're like oh my god this is gorgeous we have to like get down and take a picture i'll show you like how stunning is this oh my gosh awesome. <laughs> literally doesn't get more fresh than this it might look like watermelon mm. It looks like watermelon. <laughs> actually have to go um, pick up some stuff for my mom and for Eric's mom. Last time I was here um, we bought these like really really good cookies so I want to get a pack for my mom, a pack from us um, so we can have at the house and for my mother-in-law as well but they close at night so we're making our way over there gonna pick up that stuff. We have a little bit of champagne in the room to celebrate closing off a really good trip. Um, I don't think we're gonna get any food right now I don't, are you hungry? I'm not really I'm hungry. Kind of hungry, but we'll see. But we'll see, yeah, maybe we'll get something just because it's our last night, or maybe we'll split something, you know? Um, but we're, yeah, we're headed into the international marketplace. We're back in Waikiki, so I will vlog a little bit more once we're in the cookie shop. Thank you, thank No matcha. That's fine. Okay. This one, pineapple. Yeah. And wawa. Put a couple more That's white fine. chocolate. official day here we only have a couple hours actually because then we have to head to the airport and return the car we're very sad about it but also kind of excited to get back to our routine this is like the longest we've been without like doing right like the longest we've been without doing like our set routine or going to the gym seeing the pubs and stuff in a long long time so it's very different for us it was such a nice way to like reset and like just a really good way to start off uh, the next 10 years I don't even know if I mentioned it or not, but the whole reason we took this trip was because Wednesday was our 10 year wedding anniversary. And you guys will see like clips of that and everything like that. But what a good way to start the next 10 years off. We're trying to find some breakfast right now. Um, and then we gotta pick up some last minute gifts and then we'll be on our way to the airport. breakfast in Hawaii. We're having Leonard's. Highly recommend. Beebs is eating the guava one. And I have the chocolate. Mm. So awesome. And they actually gifted us a bottle of champagne. What a good way to close out a good vacation. So we're gonna have some drinks, enjoy the view before we gotta head out. I think we're gonna get lunch in the city real quick and then we'll probably be on our way to the airport. Thank you. 
It's her. I thought it was me. Freshness. Oh, is amazing. it fresh? Yeah. Yeah. Like added sugar. <laughs> I think I vlogged maybe in the airport. So our flight from Hawaii left at like three o'clock. At 2.50, it was supposed to depart. But of course, while we were like leaving the gate and about to take off, somebody decided that they did not want to wear their mask the right way the entire flight through. So they had to call the marshals and we had to go back to the gate. And um, we thankfully didn't have to deboard, but we were waiting for the marshals to get there so that stalled us for like a good half hour or so uh, and then when we got to san francisco we left an hour later than our scheduled um layover so when we got back to minnesota it was like 6 a.m and honestly we were so exhausted we just came home we took the dogs out to go to the bathroom real quick and we have been sleeping ever since the dogs included so <sighs> that was it for our Hawaiian vacation. Thank you guys so much for following along. I have received comments on my DMs um, or on Instagram, I should say on my DMs. I have received a couple DMs about outfits and everything. I am planning today to upload everything. So if you're not following me on the Like to Know It app, make sure you guys are follow me there. Uh, I will have all the outfits that I wore and in the vlogs, I will have the outfits that I wore as well or as many links as I could find just so you guys have those resources. Thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. If you want to see more vlogs, give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you guys are checking out the rest of my Hawaiian content that I will have up. Um, and yeah, that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay safe. And I'll see you.